Hey guys, so I am heading down to the thrift store to see what kind of actual hidden gems I will find at the thrift store. Now there's a thrift store down the street from my house. I go there once a month, maybe once every other month. But they have some decent records. Some of them are okay condition too. Sometimes you'll find a really good condition record. So yeah. I'm just walking and I should be there in five minutes so check back Hey guys, so I went to the thrift store down the street from my house and I picked up a couple of gems. Now this thrift store is a hit or miss when it comes to records. Sometimes you'll find good records and sometimes you won't find anything you want. Now, I found 80s records, Rod Stewart, and Frank Sinatra at this thrift store. But today I found some gems and I was very happy. The uh, first one I found was Face Value by Phil Kong. Now, it has some wear on it, but I don't really care. And it has one of my favorites. In the Air Tonight with that cool do 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 drum solo. And then I got Mudslide Slim by James Taylor and The Blue Horizon. Now, I got a couple James Taylor records from my dad that I forgot to show in my dad's collection. These are from the 70s. And this is James Taylor's Greatest Hits. Now, unfortunately, this one is warped. I have looked up videos on YouTube on how to fix warped records. And they said to put it in the sun under something heavy like a brick and let it flatten out. I have not tried that yet. But if you have tried it, let me know if it fixed your warp record and your record sounded better. Next one I got was James Taylor Gorilla. I'm pleasantly surprised that I found two good records at the thrift store. Now last time, or is it not last time, the second time I went to that thrift store, I asked them if they can get more Beach Boys. And they got me more Beach Boys, but unfortunately I had those albums in my collection. And they still have not sold that Beach Boys album yet. Maybe next time I go to the thrift store, I'll ask them to um, get even more Beach Boys. Because I can always use more Beach Boys in my collection. Now, I also got Dan Kroll's Emerging Adulthood coming in about two weeks. I pre-ordered that album in March. When I first heard that Dan Kroll was coming out with a new album... I had to pre-order it because I really enjoy Sweet Disarray from Dan Kroll. So also I am going to see him September the 23rd at the Terraground Ballroom. I'm really stoked for that concert. And I'm really stoked to see him again because the last time I saw him was in 2015. So it's always nice to see an artist that you haven't seen in a couple years live. So anywho, I hope you guys have a wonderful week. I'm probably, hopefully, might be going to this vegan chili cook-off tomorrow. We'll see. But anyways, have a nice week, guys. And don't forget to subscribe and like. Bye, guys. Peace.